Hi everyone! Welcome to your art class! Last session, we tackled about practice drawing things. To create a picture diagram, map or illustration to express your thoughts or to tell a story, you should practice drawing things until you can make a good sketches. The top view shown on a map is called a bird's eye view. When you practice drawing, you should draw with confidence and make the drawings simple. So for today's lesson, we will proceed with picture diagram. Picture diagram is a picture that tells the story or shows important information. Again, picture diagram is a picture that tells the story or shows important information. So the following slides are those examples for picture diagram. So please continue watching and listening because in this lesson, you will do the activity on next session. The Happy House of the Rabbit is an example of a picture diagram. We can see each part of the rabbit's happy house. They have bedroom, dining room, pantry, living room, and toilet. In this picture diagram shows that the house of the rabbit is on the ground and it also illustrates the parts of their house. We can use letters in the diagram and a provide key. Listening the names of the rooms. This makes the picture diagram less complicated to look at. Next example for the picture diagram shows the ingredients needed to make a cake. The picture diagram displays information in a form that is easy for people to understand. For the last example, I challenge you to understand the picture diagram that you can see on your screen. If a picture expresses its meaning clearly, then letters do not need to explain the story. Now let's watch the video about the tortoise and the hare. The hare and the tortoise. Long ago, in a forest, a small get-together of animals was taking place. You know what? I can beat anyone in this forest. Nobody can beat me in a race. Yes, I have seen him running. I bet he can beat anyone in this forest. Suddenly, from the crowd, they hear somebody laughing. Why are you laughing? You think you can beat me in a race? I may not disagree with you, oh Mr. Hare. But I might not deny that I have no fear of competing with you. Oh really? So let's have a race and let's see who wins. So one fine sunny day, all the animals gathered for the race. Everybody was sure that the hare is going to be a clear-cut winner. Said the hare proudly. 
<laughs> now let's go, old man. I'll beat you in a second. The hare runs so fast that all the things on the path go for a spin. On the other hand, the tortoise is running too, but at such a pace that even snails could pass by him easily. <laughs> Suddenly, the hare stops and looks behind. Oh my lord! That tortoise is gonna take ages to reach this point. So let's just stop here and take some rest. By the time he reaches here, I would get good rest and then cover him up in a blink of a second. In the meanwhile, the tortoise slowly and steadily reaches the point where the hare is fast asleep. He very quietly tiptoes past the hare and the hare is all ignorant of this fact. Suddenly, the hare gets up by the rows of the crowd, cheering up the tortoise. Go tortoise, go! Go tortoise! I kept on sleeping for so long that the tortoise is about to finish the race. He runs and runs and runs. But to his disappointment, the tortoise just manages to finish the race before he could. So the picture diagram about the tortoise and the hare tell the story or shows important information that you need to know about the story. Again, if a picture expresses its meaning clearly, then letters do not need to explain the story. I hope you understand about picture diagram. It is a picture that tells the story or shows important information. So that's all for today. Thank you 